What? What? What is up guys? I don't think I'm skating in the Skate 3 world today because that didn't really go that well. So I think we're going to a park. Well, my first park is the barracks, so let's just go there. It's been a while since I played Skate 3, so I think I'm just gonna chill here in the barracks today and get some tricks. The barracks recently posted Dane Berman's Battle Commander and Chris Weimer's Recruit, and they're just both so good. So maybe we should try to recreate some of those tricks. So Weimer, he did a bunch of cool tricks on the handrails here. He did kickflip back lip to Fagy on that, kickflip front lip to Fagy on this, kickflip tail to Fagy, and a kickflip back nose blunt. I think I want to do the kickflip back nose blunt. And I just gotta make sure we are on hardcore. Yes. Let's see if we can warm up with a little kickflip back nose blunt. Definitely not a warm up trick in real life. Backside flip alley -oop over the rail. I'm going a little too fast. Maybe we should just drop in on this right here. Like that? Yeah, it seems slow, but for a video game, it's pretty appropriate. <laughs> I'm actually really hyped on that first trick. God damn. What else did he do? Or should we get a, a Dane Berman trick now? What did Dane do? The Berman tricks might actually be tough because he built all weird crazy obstacles and I can't enter the park editor of course but he did actually session this rail right here we could do a backside blunt slide front shove out or a backside blunt like to feeble that was such a crazy trick probably one of my favorite tricks in his part actually oh yeah we gotta be goofy for this one let's see if we can do the backside blunt just to start out with Perfect. Okay, not, not a perfect landing, but it's perfect that we can do that. That's the wrong trick. Wait a minute, I got a zero shirt and a zero board. That's perfect. When we do tricks that two zero riders has had in their battle commander and recruit. We have done a blunt, so it is possible. Did I just slap it to 50? I think I'm just gonna try to film that. I don't know if I can do it any better. Let me just see. Can you go up the hopper here? Did Christian Owens make that possible when he made this park? He did! I just kind of did Chris Weimer's last trick, but I think we're gonna try to redo that. Try to clean it up. But yeah, I really want that backsmith up the hopper. Second try, I think we're taking that. Oh my god, that was so steezy. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Do I have any things I can move around? Oh, no, that was not the thing I was aiming for. I was aiming for this one. We are gonna place this over by the tents there. Because Dane Berman, he had some tricks onto this. So he did a kickflip onto it, backside 180 out. He also did a front shove onto it. And then he also did a back 50 landing on it. I'm mostly interested in the kickflip back 180. Kickflip. Maybe we have to pop it. But should we get a style on that kickflip? I kind of feel like we have to. The reason why I want to get some style on it with the Nolly inward heel is because Dane Berman actually has a good kickflip. I know we're also doing Chris Weimer tricks in this video, but Dane Berman also really has a good kickflip. But I mean, Chris Weimer has probably the best flick in the game, so... And not the game Skate 3, but the game as in, like, skateboarding. I confused myself there for a moment. I feel like Dane Berman he went a lot faster in real life, but maybe we'll just take that one. It is a video game, so we can't replicated 100 but it is fun for someone like me to kind of feel like i'm doing the tricks that my favorite skaters are doing even though i'll never do any of the stuff they're doing ah oh, dane berman he also had some really cool tricks where he had the flat bar here or well he did 5-0 over the stair here but also 5-0 shove it over the stair but i don't think we have a rail we can move no this is not a movable rail but it doesn't matter i think we are doing one more chris weimer trick you know what let's just stay over in this area move this and then get a kickflip crooked on the out ledge over the tents there that is so insane
And since it is Chris Weimer kickflip, it's probably not unrealistic if we pop too high. Even though normally I would kind of like make sure I only just got on top of the ledge. I didn't get into a grind there? Now that was a really weird crooked grind. I think that was more like a willy. Definitely not gonna take that. Oh, can we save that? I kind of rotated on the way out, but I think it looks really cool. He did the he did the bone tweak out of the crooked grind. It's amazing. All right, that was fine. I'm just gonna take that. I think I'm going for another Dane Berman trick. So we are gonna take this bench right here. We don't need don't need the thing underneath it. Oh no. Upright object. Perfect. And we are gonna place this bench right over here. And then we are gonna do a front board. Yeah, we can actually just do a front board. We can do a front board fakie or front board shove out. I do have a problem with making front board shove outs realistic in this game. So maybe we'll just go for the fakie one. But once again, we gotta get into Goofy. I almost just gapped out to the bench. It's crazy how little speed you need in this game. We really don't need a lot. Now we can do that bit. Let's just try to shove it out. See if I can do that. What? What? I mean, that might be the best I can do it. Let's try to film that. That was actually pretty cool. And I didn't even notice we already had benches back here. I could... I didn't even have to take it from all the way back there, but all right. Should we get the Chris Why? Oh man, there's so much we can do here. We can do kickflip backsmith, backsmith kickflip out, front heel or front big spin. I think I'm gonna do the backsmith kickflip out on the very thin hopper. So let's see. Whoa, it's just... We have the kicker there, so I really don't need that much pop, I think. Keep landing on that kick, though. Damn it! I might just have to take that one. Had to go so slow for it, but... I mean, it was a backsmith kick flip out. Alright, that was actually pretty cool, but I just got... A pretty cool idea if you can do this and I honestly don't know if you can but we are gonna take this monster oh no please tell me we can move it can we move we can't move them I really really want to do the nose blunt oh my god I can move this but not the vending machines what is going on Oh man, I might have to give up. It's because I haven't completed the game on my friend's account, so I can't enter the park editor. Damn. Dane also did a tray flip tail grab, I think you would call it. Maybe it was a Benihana, I don't really know. But how about we try that? So let's just get this one out of here and... Can we really carve into it? If we like go down that ramp? God damn it, I really wanted that nose blunt on the vending machine. That could have been so awesome. Oh wow, maybe this isn't the hip either. Can I not finish this video with the Dane Berman trick? Oh yeah. Normally I skate regular in this game, so I just gotta... Gotta figure out how to do a tail grab in Goofy. We even did it with a grind before it. Tray flip tail grab. <laughs> I don't know if that's... Is that really the trick we're ending with? I kind of feel like we have to do one more trick to end the video. Because we already did Chris Weimer's last trick. So what if we also do Dane Berman's last trick? 
I was inside the ramp there. Okay, so the problem is that in his part, Dane, he wasn't skating the regular handrail. I think he was skating the kinked handrail. So it was going down straight and then turning when the other bench came in. I don't know if we can do that or if we land on this ledge here. <laughs> Another problem I didn't even think about was that the handrail seems lower than the bench. Oh my god. Seriously? The handrail is lower than the bench. Get this thing away. You know what? I think we're just gonna use this one. And then actually get, get into the bank that Dane also got into in real life. Please, come on! <laughs> I think I'm just gonna take that one. Let's just check it out first. It was so hard to maintain the speed throughout the second slide, so I think we're just gonna take that. We we did Chris Weimer's last trick and also Dane Berman, so I'm actually pretty happy with this video. I think we got some cool stuff and it was really fun to do these tricks. And if you haven't seen Chris Weimer's Recruit and Dane Berman's Battle Commander, I highly suggest it. It's on the Barracks YouTube channel, so go ahead and watch those because they are pretty damn amazing. And if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to leave a like. Also remember to subscribe and of course hit that bell to stay notified for future uploads here on the channel. And then I just gotta say thank you so much for watching and supporting me. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.